I am here in beautiful Ecuador with tour guide slash entomologist Nancy Miarelli, and we are going to find out what's tougher, Dobson flies or human flesh. This is a Dobson fly. She's a female. You can tell because her mandibles are pretty short. The what? males have mandibles that are like a third of the length of the body. And if you take a look at her, she has her two compound eyes, and she has these little things on the top of her head. Uh, these are ocelli. These are simple eyes. They can only re really detect light and dark. Yeah, and I, for some stupid reason, have decided to let them both bite me to see which one is stronger. Battle of the sexes. Thanks a lot to Nancy. You know, you're supposed to be my tour guide. You're supposed to keep me safe on this trip, but you dared me to do this. What? What are you even talking about? I didn't even dare you to do this. This was your idea. <laughs> you cannot blame me for this. Okay, here we go. I'm gonna die. It's gonna it's gonna rip my freaking finger off. It probably won't even. What do are the hospitals to you? like around here? Are they, are they good? Uh, the hospitals, yeah, they're pro they're pretty good. Uh, they does my insurance work here? I don't know. Uh, probably doesn't cover Dobson fly bites. As you see, he's uh. Uh yeah, I'm gonna use my pinky. Really doing some damage. <gasps> oh boy. <laughs> oh, it bit me. Did it hurt? Actually. <laughs> Actually, it didn't really hurt. I think I just freaked out for no reason. <laughs> you probably Is did more damage bug gonna to be it okay? than he did to you. I mean, I guess they throw each... Oh, man. I feel bad now. <laughs> Don't feel bad. I guess they do throw each other around like that, right? That's... Mm, not really. Ugh. They have exoskeletons, though. You don't, however. <sighs> okay. This time I'm gonna be careful and not hurt the bug. Mm-hmm. <laughs> what the heck? Seriously, it doesn't even hurt at all. Like not even a little bit. It's it's just like gently massaging. My <laughs> you were so scared. Oh. Don't you Why feel is silly so now? so scared? Okay, let's see what the female can do. Yeah, we'll just move him over here, I guess. There it looks good. Oh. Oops. Sorry, little lady. Yes. But your boyfriend is being silly. He's getting in the way here. I'll just move him, I guess. Or he'll just move oh, himself. Oh, look at that. He found a nice, safe place to stay. Okay, it's your turn. Uh, Don't freak out like last I'm time. I'm scared again. Y'all are freaking out. I think she might actually. Ah. Yeah. And? Well, I mean, okay, her bite is definitely worse. Clearly. But it still doesn't even hurt. Like, she's, it's nothing. <laughs> it really, honestly, it's nothing. These things cannot hurt humans. She's not even trying. It's all for show. Battle of the sexes, female wins, but not by very much. I can't freaking believe I was so scared of these things. <laughs> well, there you have it, folks. There's no reason to be afraid. This video was filmed in Ecuador by my buddy Isaiah, who in his craziness, found super cheap plane tickets for himself, artist Chris Adams, and me. But there was a catch to these cheap plane tickets. They only gave us three days in Ecuador, so we had to plan every moment of the trip extremely wisely. And that is where Nancy came in. Nancy lives in Ecuador, and she runs a little tour guide company. She had us fill out a questionnaire to figure out what our interests were, and then she planned this entire trip for us. She just loaded it with crazy adventures like the one you just saw. All the photos on display here we took in just three days. And best of all, Nancy is a trained entomologist. She is a scientist that studies bugs. Her knowledge allowed us to explore the cloud forests really in the most unexpected and beautiful way I ever could have imagined. With her help, we knew exactly what insects we could touch, how to do so safely for ourselves and for the insects, and we knew which ones we should avoid. So, come to Ecuador, and when you do so, hire Nancy to be your tour guide. She's awesome. I give her five stars. To get a hold of her, you just contact her on Facebook under Cybugs. There's a link in the video description. Again, that's Cybugs. Whether or not you're going to hire her, make sure to follow her on Facebook, because she has lots of cool stuff about insects on there that she posts. Also, make sure to check out the artwork of Chris Adams, who was with us on our trip. Again, there's a link in the video description. He does a lot of work with mushrooms, and he designed the t-shirt that you saw me wearing. There's also a link down there for you to Isaiah's work. He does film and design, so check that out for your viewing pleasure.
So long for now, my curious friends. Remember, it's always good to go outside and play.